teach you how to use the move trigger children that and it's actually pretty simple to use the move trigger once you find out how it works and it's actually also pretty simple to learn how the move trigger works um i'm gonna I'm gonna teach you something about the move trigger. Oh, I don't you just make a new level. Da, da. Oh, wait, so now you probably don't know. Oh, wait, so now chances are you don't know how this trigger, why right here, the move trigger works. But don't worry, because I'm gonna help you. Because I'm gonna teach you how this this trigger works. Oh, wait, so now first off, you If you're a new player, you wanted to make moving objects. You probably just started messing around with. You probably just. You probably just started messing around. You you probably just started messing around. You probably just started messing around. Around in here. Here, but you can't just mess around like you expect. How you can? You got a fireball. Oh, oh, no, should be it. Number one will be the piece about the move. Oh. oh. If you can hear a voice in the background, this is my, wait, this is my boy playing with us. friend. I try to, yeah, not have a lot of back First off, you might think that this target move ID thing is this. Is this screw right? Is this ID thing? But that, but it's not this. It's actually the. It doesn't rely on this. It relies on it relies on this thing called edit group right here. You see, let's type. For example, we can type in free and add that, and then we can talk about group ID free. Why right now it doesn't do anything? But that's because we have to do, do this right here, which is edit object. And if you use edit, you suddenly can see that. So now, I recommend not using the steel wall because it's just like speeding. Good. If, if, if you want to make a good start, a good looking moving object, then I recommend, then I recommend you set it to 0 0.3. But if you try to make a troll level, then I recommend you do set it to 0 0.05. Right, because any slower will basically make you die either way. So it's like, yeah, and this X and Y basically determines determines how long long you move it's also but if you put these but if you put but if you put these two together I use a sword feature at the edit feature and the groove if we impart and there's also noise coming from outside because I live in the fifth biggest city in my country which is on Denmark I don't know the population but I assume it's around like 50,000 people this year. okay yeah 
a survival zone that will usually be outside because there's like something going on outside. Alright, so yeah, it's basically. So, if you hear a lot more noise, then, then it's coming from outside, Asia. You could also use the move trigger for this. And then you, and then you can set it to 9999, which is the match. And then you can lock to play X and Y, and then... Oh, what happened? What happened? Joe Yeah. And you can make it fall for you. I'm not gonna lie, it is gonna be off set. So you wanna put your more in. And if you wanna take it to the next level and make it look like you're the block, then the high trigger. Anyways, yeah, that's how the move trigger